Hello to everybody, I'm Francesca and today I would like to speak with you about life. Yes, because I think that anybody of us has similar experience about life. For example, when you wake up, isn't it the best moment of the day? Yes, of course, because no matter which kind of life you have, such an exciting life or a shitty life, in the moment when you wake up, where you are in your wonderful bed, under your wonderful blanket, so soft, so comfortable, and the temperature is almost perfect, you don't want to wake up, you just want to stay there, because you know that in the moment that you put your feet out of the bed, it can always get worse, it can always get worse, so you're there, and you're like dreaming, ah, oh, I just want to stay longer, and you start to feel, no, I have to be, no, no, I have to poo even worse, I can't poo inside of my bed, and your mouth tastes like shit, because Let's say the truth, almost anybody of us, when we wake up, our smell doesn't, doesn't taste so good. So from the night before, you have a glass of tap water, yes, because you even finished the sparkling water, and the glass stayed there all night, so the water really tastes like shit, but you drink it because you want to stay longer in the bed, even if you are so thirsty, but suddenly you need to pee, and so you wake up and things go worse and worse. So I'm not going to speak about the poo because uh, I'm a girl so I'm not speaking about the poo but I'm going to speak about brushing teeth. Yes, because I believe that in the world there are two big political parties about washing teeth. That is one, my side that I don't really care much, you know. I just want that my mouth smell good because um, my teeth of course are not so dirty in the reality in the morning because I didn't eat yet but they don't smell good, they don't smell good. So what happened is that I just put the, the toothpaste inside of my mouth. I don't even use the toothbrush. I just put the toothpaste inside of my mouth. like And in this way, my mouth smells like, um, like mint, like mint, and my boyfriend thinks that my mouth smells good and I'm happy, finish, that, that's it. There is the other partisan that they are upset about washing teeth and they wake up in the morning and they're like every morning 20 minutes you have to rotation round to wash your teeth perfectly in the right way. And these kind of people, they are so afraid about getting um, the, the sick teeth, the, the black teeth, and they are so afraid about spending money to the dentist, they are so stingy, and they are upset that they, at least 20 minutes, they wash their teeth in the right way, but it's not finished, they use the uh, w uh, mouthwash, that is like a kind of nuclear bomb, you know, you, you, you drink it, and it's like, it's like kill anything inside of your mouth that it's so traumatic for the morning because I mean in the morning you want to be relaxed you want to drink a coffee you don't want to do that and then you they also use the uh, oh my god I lost it uh, they also use the um, I, I don't know how to call it the uh, to flo floss and they get so much blood, but they are happy because more blood you get, more tartar you, you lose, and this is good for them, you know, so traumatic. I, I, I really hope I will never date a person like that. And then there is even the third kind, that it's a funny kind, the, the one of the electric toothbrush. Mine is so old, uh, I never used it, I keep it in my bath to give a good impression, but actually it's so dirty, it looks so bad now that I, I watch it, that maybe I should throw it away, <laughs> yes. And the point is that, in my opinion, the sound um, reminds me to a motorcycle in the highway in the traffic, where I'm gonna be after 10 minutes after I brush my teeth. No, it's like... <laughs> No, it's like a motor, and it, it's so the, the, the sound is terrible. I really don't like it. It's like broom, broom, broom. And um, the point is that it's even more violent against your teeth, against your uh, mouth, and I really don't like it. And I saw that uh, they sell these for children with the song of your favorite pop star. So every morning when you wake up, 
you brush your teeth and you listen to the song of your favorite uh, pop star so if you love Lady Gaga and uh, uh, Poker Face in a few months, in a few uh, mornings you will hate Lady Gaga it's a good, uh, it's a good way to change taste in music and um, uh, what else? Uh, then there is the breakfast and also about the breakfast in my opinion there are two big differences there are the women in love and the women that are not in love the woman not in love, they just press a button, they make a coffee with the machine and that's it. But be worried about that kind of woman, be worried, because in Italy we say, you know what I mean. I mean, a woman in love would put more effort in your breakfast, so be worried. Maybe that woman just takes some cereal, some milk, that's it, you know. Then there is the second kind, that is the woman in love. The woman in love. She wanna be the perfect wife, the perfect girlfriend. And what happened is that she wake up at six in the morning with this idea of the perfect family, of the perfect breakfast. And so she go out in the garden searching for fresh fruit. Yes, because um, of the perfect breakfast have to have wild blackberry, raspberries, it, it can just be a cake, you know, it have to be fresh. And so if you don't have a garden, you go to talk, uh, talk, talk to the grocery store at six in the morning, searching for some fresh fruit and the, the guy of the grocery is like, oh my God, what's wrong with you? I don't want to wake up at this time. Why do you do that? And, uh, or uh, um, uh, the, the neighbor, if, if they see you from the window, they think, uh, uh, who is that girl in pyjama in six in the morning searching for food? Maybe it's the girl that was murdered a few nights before. Maybe we should call the FBI. But the woman in love, she doesn't care. Her only goal is to make the perfect breakfast. So she starts to cook and cook and cook and cook. Her ego is so big. Why she cook? You have no idea. She feels so so useful you know and she cooked too much like crap waffles and french toast and she even go into the balcony and open the barbecue even if uh, in italy we don't eat meat in the morning she thinks oh my man it's so masculine it's so testosterone that he would start to eat meat in the morning and he make she makes this huge huge table she feels like she's saint mary or even better she's like the mother nature feeding the world and the boyfriend just came out of the stair and with the eyes like closed like big like that the mouth like the face like she's like in a horrible outfit and he said to her uh just make me a coffee and you are like oh okay and you understood that the the girl not in love is smarter than the girl in love <laughs> so i will tell you more about my life next time we, we you will see my video i hope you enjoyed it have a great day bye bye